and Dominican Sue, University of Nebraska. Defensive tackle. Our first test for this 6'4", 300 pounder is to measure his explosion off the line of scrimmage. We're using high-tech sensors to gauge his reaction time and acceleration. We want to see how fast you go from zero to your top gear. All right. That's fast. I just showed my burst off the line of scrimmage. That's the best thing to do at my position to have quick reaction time. Sue reacts to the trigger in only 26 hundredths of a second. That's the fastest reaction time we tested, including backs and receivers. This is because Sue launches like a true sprinter. For that crucial first step, he keeps his back nearly parallel to the ground, maximizing his horizontal force. Sue hits a top speed of 13.5 miles an hour in only 1.3 seconds at the six yard mark. Our analysis of Sue's acceleration and speed reveals that incredibly over 20 yards, this 300 pounder is flat out faster than Tony Romo. Next test, the heavy bag gauntlet. To replicate the challenges of moving through a wall of blockers, Sue must navigate a series of 300 pound heavy bags and then tackle our crash test dummy. What kind of technique do you use when you see an open shot like this? I'm driving through them, keep the feet running, right. and I take them to the ground as hard as I can. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Dude, oh my god. Sue crushes our crash test dummy with over 3,200 pounds of force. That's the biggest impact we've ever measured. Even more than hits by sports science alums Ray Lewis and Chris Jenkins. That's the biggest yeah. hit. It's a big, yeah, that's the biggest we've had. Normally we compare this to a car crash, but honestly, you're like a freight train. Good comparison, keep it that way. This combination of speed and power will make Indomitian Sue a force to be reckoned with in the NFL. For Sports Science on ESPN, I'm John Brinkus.